Hey everyone, I just want to do a quick video and show you guys. I ordered from Union Sourcing. I was watching a video from Ghost Tea House, I believe is a YouTube channel, and he really recommended Union Sourcing, and I can't wait to eventually order some of their teas, but I saw these really small, <clears throat> excuse me, Gong Fu style pots, and they have four styles. I want to get them all, but I I like this one the most and said, let me order one and see how it is. Look how cute. Um, just for size comparison, this is a small cup and this is a pin. It's, it's tiny, but it is perfect for individual brewing. I saw some similar on AliExpress, but they didn't look as good quality um, and they didn't look as big. This to me is a size between a traditional Yishin clay pot and like the what they call the fingertip like the little collectible ones this is kind of in in between so it came very well wrapped in a ton of bubble wrap now this website union sourcing they have a u.s website which is where i ordered this pot from don't be confused because they have a china website the prices on the China website are cheaper per item, but you're going to pay, depending on the items you add to your cart, your shipping rate's going to go up. Whereas on the U.S. site, um, I believe it goes up to like $10 flat rate, something like that. Um, and if you do order from the U.S. site, I did contact them and ask. It does come from the U.S., so shipping was pretty quick. I think I got this within a week or so. Um, whereas on the China website, they have it in red, especially with, with what's going on with COVID, that it can take seven to eight weeks. Don't order if you don't want to wait that long. So um, anyway, so I ordered this one from the US site just to try them out. I was very happy um, with it. And I just wanted to show you guys because I was getting ready to use it. Like, I just love how cute this little box is. I think I'm going to keep it and, and keep it in there. But... I'm also going to get my Yixing clay pot and show you guys the size difference. This is a, I believe, a Celadon pot. And it has the, um, the cracked glazing on it. And in person, it's just really pretty. Really, really pretty. Let me show you. Look at it. it fits in my hand no marking on the bottom but close up it it's very nice very very nice i believe this one holds 50 mils so there is a little tape i haven't looked inside i did just peek inside the box a bit they say a good pot will make a sound like a sword or like a clinking so it does make a good um, sound. Look how thin but well crafted that is. So there's no filter inside, but it is still got the cracked glazing. And then it has a little, you know, hole at the top right there. And then just for size comparison, show you guys. So here is a Yixing clay pot. And then here's the mini celadon. So, if you're going to use it with a small teacup, you know, it'd be okay for one person. But I just love, like, miniature and small stuff. I can't wait to get them all. I think they're just freaking cute and would be great to travel with. So, yeah, just wanted to show you guys that. And I'll link Union Sourcing below if you guys have ordered from them. Let me know in the comments below and give me some recommendations on what I should try. Okay, I'm going to test how it pours for the first time. It didn't do too bad. For a tiny little pot. 